Dr. Meyer, welcome and thank you for giving us some time to uh, talk on uh, eCancer TV. Yeah. You're from Hamburg, you are on the board of the European uh, Society for Oncology Pharmacy that's and you're now a member of ECHO. Yes. So that's, that's yes. a real step forward for, yeah. for the oncology pharmacist. And, uh, and you are the representative uh, on the ECHO board. Yes. Good. Tell us about the, the society. So uh, the society was founded in the year, year 2000 in Prague. So we have now a birthday next year, the 10th birthday. And uh, we have done a lot of work to bring uh, the countries in Europe together. And uh, based on our quality standard, we discussed uh, several times uh, also with the European Commission last year, finally. And uh, we have now run about uh, 33 countries together uh, concerning uh, more than 2,000 members. Oh. With uh, one basically uh, decision that one country, one vote. So you can uh, have a look. In Germany, perhaps we have 600 members. UK, f 500. France, nearly 400. But also we have one ma member from Malta, two from Iceland two from Cyprus, you know. One vote per country. One vote per country. That's terrific. Good yeah. stuff. So you're telling me about some guidelines and you've done some yeah. really interesting work on, uh, on your society. Yes. We started in the beginning to look uh, how we could make the centralized preparation safer. Mm -hmm. So, you know, when you work uh, on cytotoxic. cytotoxic preparation, centralized the cytotoxic preparation, and you know that so uh, under these conditions, when you work the whole day, you have to, to look uh, that the conditions are good to save for your body and your life. Mm, that was the f beginning of our work. But then we saw, concerning the collaboration with physicians, we thought it necessary to understand why this prescription has been done, to understand how high the concentration must be or not. So we had to learn a little bit more about patient and uh, the, the position of physicians to reflect the patient situation. And this was the, the second step to come to this decision to look for pharmaceutical care and uh, conditions uh, of uh, the body uh, of the patient, kidney, liver and so on. And that's why we uh, have uh, expanded uh, the discussion uh, coming from the preparation to the treatment in, in general. And you've translated the, uh, the guidelines into what? Yes, so we, we have translated them into now 22 languages, but the, the 23rd uh, translation is on the move, uh, that's Hindi. You know, yes, and we will have then the presentation also in India. But anyway, so we have covered uh, all European languages, uh, in addition uh, Chinese, in addition uh, Vietnamese, and uh, also Arab, uh, Arabian language. The future for the society? The future is to collaborate. Uh, we do this uh, since uh, several uh, years with the Asian societies and that we learn from each another. Uh, and um, also the big uh, goal we have is to um, make a, a changement in mind of everybody working together in uh, oncology because, you know, we are now talking in this echo meeting from uh, interdisciplinarity, multidisciplinarity. But what we need in future is to discuss multiprofessionality, you know, because the professions of nurses, pharmacists, and others collaborating with physicians for good uh, uh, support for patients is very necessary. 